about us. International Council for Rights and Relief, ICRR, formerly known as International Council for Rights and Freedoms, ICRF, is a humanitarian aid and civil rights nonprofit and non-governmental 501c3 organization established in May 2014. The main office is located in the state of Michigan, USA, and another office in Yemen. ICRR focuses on humanitarian relief during wars, armed conflicts, famine, and natural disasters by offering help to affected people with food, shelters, medicine, clothing, and other desperately needed resources and aid. ICRR is focusing on Yemen, where the humanitarian crisis was acknowledged by the UN as the worst in the world at its time. ICRR fights against poverty and provides help in economic and human sustainable development for all, with a focus on marginalized groups. ICRR supports and defends civil liberties and the human rights of individuals and groups worldwide. The goal of ICRR is the development of societies based on peaceful coexistence, justice, and acceptance of others regardless of their beliefs, cultures, and ethnicities. Our mission to defend rights and freedoms, raise community legal awareness, provide humanitarian relief assistance to those who need it wherever they are, and contribute to human and economic development for all, while focusing on marginalized groups, changing their lives for the best. Our vision. Have societies based on justice, equality, preserving human dignity and free of poverty, starvation, and disease, a society in which the individual develops and contributes to the overall development process. Current Alarming Situation The UN considers Yemen to be the world's largest humanitarian crisis, with 14 million people at risk of starvation and repeated outbreaks of deadly diseases like cholera. This crisis is linked to the armed conflict, the humanitarian crisis in Yemen remains the worst in the world. Nearly five years of conflict has forced more than 4.3 million people to leave their homes, and an estimated 82% of the population, 24.1 million people, are in urgent need of humanitarian assistance. Since violence broke out in early 2015, conditions in Yemen, already one of the poorest countries in the Middle East, have rapidly deteriorated driving the country to the brink of widespread famine and economic collapse. Extreme shortages of food, safe water, sanitation, and health care, as well as deadly massive outbreaks of cholera and diphtheria, have taken a heavy toll on civilian lives and have deprived families of basic needs. 77 out of 1,000 children die due to malnutrition, according to the UNHCR. According to the Guardian newspaper, the death toll in Yemen's war since 2015 has reached 100,000 innocent lives. Our Contributions Food Relief ICRR has been providing food assistance, food baskets distributions, since 2015 to more than 43,000 families, feeding an estimated 258,000 individuals across nine Yemeni governorates, costing $530,000. We strive to provide aid to those in need for all 22 governorates in future efforts. Emergency Relief ICRR provides emergency relief to refugees, displaced and disabled people in Yemen, and to the victims of natural disasters in the U.S. with necessary resources. Health ICRR has provided three public hospitals with medical equipment and supplies for the cost of $1.6 million. ICRR also helped to establish and develop a dialysis center in the isolated area of Al Dalia province. Human Rights and Humanitarian Developments ICRR participated in the United Nations Conference on Human Settlement Habitat in Ecuador in 2016 and its followed session in Malaysia in 2018. ICRR participated in two symposiums in New York and Geneva with emphasis on humanitarian needs in Yemen.
At last but not least, we extend our sincere thanks to all supporters, organizations, and individuals who expressed human solidarity with the victims of wars, armed conflicts, natural disasters, famine, and the suppression of rights and freedoms, and put their marks in the memory of children, the poor, and the oppressed. And we hope that the humanitarian support will continue in the coming years for all the victims, wherever and without limits. Thank you.